So hello guys, this is a little bit different of a video. Um, today I'm at Edinburgh Manor. It's one of the most haunted places in Iowa. Um, my mom lives out here a few miles away in a little town called Anamosa. We spent the night here. We paid $200 for an overnight. And let me tell you, this place is, it's not so bad in the morning, but at night, it's terrifying. Um, so yeah, this is one of the most haunted places in Iowa. Uh, it's one of the top five most haunted places in the United States, actually, I think. It was a poor house, they, and then they tore down the poor house and made this building, which is a insane asylum. So it's an abandoned insane asylum. And um, there is over 82 reported deaths here, plus the ones that aren't accounted for. Um, so, how old is this place? When did it open? Like 1950 something? Yeah, this building did. And the it other closed. Building was in 1830. Yeah, and it closed down in 2010. So, it's been a working property since the 30s. 18. So, this is a safe room. This is where we stayed when we got scared. It's where we ate. This was where the waiting room was. And the little girl here, her name is Susie, people bring her offerings. Down there is the woman's wing. Down there is the men's wing. Susie, Susie's room is down there. Well, that's where she likes to hang out. This is the little sun room. There's a few offerings because people bring Susie toys and stuff because she'll play with them. And someone ate some of the sandwich that we left out <laughs> yesterday. Down there is to the basement. Up there is to the first floor, which is the most haunted um, floor in the building. Down there is the rec room with the pool table. Here is Susie's room. We left her some candy and a stuffed animal and a coloring book earlier. So we've come in here. You should get the window or that room where the, um... And here was a room where a man hung himself from a doorknob. He hung himself and killed himself on the doorknob. That's a long story. Down here, some more bedrooms. Bathroom, shower, the urinal, and such. And the rec room, where we saw a really scary shadow last night, and it scared the crap out of us. Do not know what it was. But pool table. Right in this window next to the pool table. None of us were standing there. We were all back here. Wow. Really? Balcony. Rocking, and shattered it. Wow. This is the rack room. Here is the woman's ward. Super cold in here. Like a little barber shop. Some more rooms. We heard a few noises down here last night, up, but coming from upstairs. I'm very leery over here. This is where I heard my noise, and this is where somebody touched my back in this room. And in here, a woman was raped in this bed repeatedly, so none of us want to go near that bed. There's a documented, reported rape of a woman laying in this bed. They say if you lay in this bed, you'll feel the, the fear that she felt. If you really want to. Don't leave me here. Don't lay in that bed. Here's like a little, maybe this room was like arts and crafts room or something. It's one of the carpeted rooms. That little room back there is that barber shop room. This is a bathroom that actually still has um, curtains and stuff. Uh, one of the bathtub rooms. One of the little common areas, or a bedroom, I guess. 
another bathroom and like an extra little bedroom. Okay, so now we're heading upstairs on the first floor. Last night when me and my mom came up here, we couldn't even stay up here. It was so cold. It was just really bad negative feelings up here. It was scary up here last night. Really scary up here. In this bedroom, uh, last night you could see our breath. It was so cold in there. Another one of the men's bedrooms. I may not have enough memory on my phone to do the basement, but... Another bathroom. <coughs> Whale. And this is Rusty's room. You are not supposed to go in there because he does not like people in his room. So don't go in there. This is the room where the owner slept in and he felt something touching his foot. In this bed. This bedroom is like a little get together room. A few creepy dolls. <laughs> I don't even know what room I would want. Uh, I'm going to try to get the basement, so I'm not going to show you guys the woman's ward, but this is the purple room where a lot of stuff happens, too. Yeah. But, yeah. Here's this bathroom. This bathroom's big. And now we hit the basement where Rusty lives, the Joker, as most people call him. This is the kitchen. Well, Sign your name, door. Okay, over here is where the owner saw. Don't leave me, guys. The well, boiler room is back there. So here's the scary boiler room. It's very scary back here. Scary place. This is the dining room where they ate. So that's about it. That's Edinburgh Manor. Thanks for watching.